Hello folks, welcome to another Let's Play. This is a game that kind of missed me by at the time. Uh, I played through red and blue and yellow, and then I've never finished any of the ones afterwards. I'll see how this one uh, goes. Whoops. With uh, copyrights and stuff. I don't plan to play through this super fast. Charizard. And I am playing the gold version. And fast battle shift. There we go. Ellipses, ellipses. Zzz, mm, wah, 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 you woke me up. Will you check the clock for me? What time is it? Day ten o'clock. Morning. Day. Five o'clock. How many minutes? Two. Two minute, yes. Yes, I did oversleep. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Prof. Meryl! Was that Meryl? Was that Mary Lee? I don't remember. Some people play with Pokemon, some battle with them. I am a vicious trainer myself. In fact, I'm not even a real scientist. By study, he means watch them in his lab. Oh, I'm getting that weird sound thing again. Occasionally you have to... I don't know. I've always had that in this emulator. Oh no, shark, I'm playing an emulator. Carl! And we'll go for a semi-humorous name. Did I? Did I? Are you ready? You'll face fun times and tough challenges, a world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon Awaits. Let's go. I'll be seeing you later. And... Yeah, it's... Yeah, that's right. Did I turn on the PC? Oh, it was the fun we had. I can put away my bed. Hmm. Professor Oak's Pokey Talk. Please tune in next time. The Pokemon Channel. DJ Mary. Doom, doom. A whole collection of Pokemon picture books. Because, you know, I'm not old enough to read proper books yet. Oh, did I? Our neighbor, Professor Elm, was looking for you. He said he wanted you to do something for him. Oh, I almost forgot. Your Pokemon gear is back from the repair shop. Here you go. Did I receive Pokemon gear? You mustn't forget that. What day is it? Spoilers, it's Wednesday. Or Wednesday, depending on how you speak. No, it is not. Yes, it is. Do I know how to use the phone? Yes. Gee, isn't that convenient? Almost like save states are convenient. There's a movie on TV. Stars through the skies as two boys riding a train. I'd better get rolling too. So... That is home. Yo, did I? I hear Professor Elm discovered some new Pokemon. Did I's house? <laughs> sure you can. New back town. Yes, yeah, so I've never actually finished these, like I say. And I decided I'll play through it. 
numerous names will ensue for Pokemon. I wonder I have to read into that, because that sound does get annoying after a while. Sometimes it just randomly goes. Pikachu's an evolved Pokemon? No, it is not. Pokemon magazines, Pokemon Pal, Pokemon Handbook, Pokemon Graph. It's a TV. Pokemon. No. Oh, who was gonna say don't play that junk again? So what's that one? Oh, Elm's house. Well, let's go and sneak into Professor Elm's house, see what he's got. He has a wife and kid. Hi, did I? He even forgets to eat. I'm going to be a great Pokemon professor. Pokemon Master! Why you no Pokemon Doctor? Why has no one ever witnessed a Pokemon's birth? That's because Pokemon aren't born. Oh, the simplicities of the older games. Dun. Did I? I need to ask you a favor. Did I? Mr. Pokemon. <laughs> Basically, he's my friend, but he fills me full of junk email. Hey, you gonna do this for me? I'll give you a free Pokemon. It's the Slave Animal Trade. They're all rare. If a wild Pokemon appears, let your Pokemon battle it. Right. Stop that. I have a choice between, is it Chikorita, Totodile, and Cyndaquil? Speaking of which... Um... I like... I generally, when I first played it, I always went for Bulbasaur, I always thought he was the better Pokemon, but I like playing with the Fire-type. So... I'll just view those to see them. Even though everybody will have seen it by now. I like the fact he has these three Pokemon on a table right next to a bin. So he's kind of like they're going, well, if no one will take you, I'm just going to throw you right in the bin. Yes, I will take Cyndaquil. Did I receive Cyndaquil? I don't remember. Right, and Cyndaquil will be given a nickname. And this is out to LP Gamer. He will be called Spaff. Cherry Grove, the next city. It's almost a direct route to there. If your Pokemon is here, you should heal it with this machine. Oh, here's my phone number. Call me if something comes up. Did I get Elmer's number? If only I could change the punctuation and wording in this game. Did I? I want you to have this for your errand. Did I receive the potion? Well then, Professor Elm needs to hire more people. This is uh, our rival as well. Off on our adventure. Route 29! Pokemon hide in the grass, who knows when they'll pop out. Don't pop out, are you gonna... <laughs> who knows when they'll pop out? I'll just eat... Jo! Go, Spaff! If anyone, um... By the time this video's up has come across that weird thing where I'm using Visual Boy Advance to play it. Although I am actually going to buy a cart of this as well. Spaff, how could you miss? Um, I just noticed as well, Spaff's a female. Yeah, if anyone could tell me if it's a setting I can choose on that or what. Because it just ever so often... The only way I found it is you just speed the emulator up and it works 
works it out for a bit, but whatever. What I'm probably going to do is try and get Mr. Pokemon, and then go from there. And any other story and stuff I'll do, I hope not to do, I should say. I will fight some Pokemon when I can, and level up before the next video. On we go. That is back where I came from. Yo, how are your Pokemon? If they're weak and not ready for battle, keep out of the grass, or you'll get your ass handed to you. And I have to go up that way, so I will cheat. And we've seen this now. Oh, it automatically used the potion. Spaff learned smoke screen. Good old Spaff. So I saved to record my progress. Speaking of which, let's make an actual Game Boy save. Did I? I don't remember. That's not the place I want to go. If you want to catch them all, you have to look everywhere. You can't climb ledges, but you can jump down from them to take a shortcut. Because we all like scraped knees. Oh, the joys. Suck it, Pidgey. Get me out of that grass. I'll talk to the other person later. See those ledges? It's scary to jump off them. Well, no, duh, they're a ledge. Where are we at? Route 29, Cherry Grove City, New Back Town. Eh? Oh, hello, you're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you like, I can teach you a few things. Oh, yeah. Okay, then, follow me. This is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You've been relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. This is a Pokemart. They sell their balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. I like the balls the most. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling the prize Pokemon there. I don't know why I brought you here. I just like the sea. Some Pokemon are found only in water. Stop that damn sound glitch. Oh, um, here. Oh, it's my house. Oh, thanks for your company. I'm not allowed to walk out on my own anymore. I received a map. I wish you luck on your journey, young fella. What a strange old man. When you're with Pokemon, going anywhere is fun. Even the ride to hell. Mr. Pokemon's house is still further up. I didn't set anything off to tell me how long I've been playing for, have I? Oops. Oh well. Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemons are fully healed. Let me show them to you. Ooh, almost pressed shift. Right, I'm not going to talk to them for now, because it doesn't change what they say for a long while. Caterpie! Let's just speed this odd part up. Oh. Route 30, Violet City to Cherry Grove City. Check out the nut tree! Oh, fruit rather. Heel berry! Did I put the berry in the item pocket? I don't remember. Oh no, that was it. Spaff must have had a berry on them. From what I remember, Pokemon can hold items, can't they? And if it's... Yeah, they can use old items, they can use berries and things. When they get really low on health. Um... Yes, and the backpack changed as well. Poker gear. Press any button to... Why would I want to exit? There's the map. Let's call Mother. Hello? Oh, hi, did I bring you? You're on a big mission for press. Don't be good. Click. Don't put the phone down on me! 
think it's this way to Pokemon's. Yep. Through the tall grass. Yeah, there we go. It automatically uses the berries and things when they're injured, don't they? It's been a while. Because berries go and stuff. Poison cure berry. They're every 24 hours? Did I put it in the pocket? I don't remember. Oh, that'll never get old. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. Did I receive mystery egg? Did I put the mystery egg in the key pocket? They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm for Pokemon Evolution. Professor Elm is the authority. Even Professor Oak here recognizes that. If my assumption is correct, Professor Elm will know it. Aha! So, yo did I! I'm Oak! A Pokemon researcher! Ash is not here right now. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm. So I waited here. What's this? A rare Pokemon? Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. Bitch, it's dangerous to go out in the tall grass without one. Aye, Pokemon are our friends. Professor Oak is suddenly Yorkshire. He saw that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? Uh, it depends. Nothing weird, right? Oh, that's okay. He's giving me a new Pokedex. I received Pokedex? Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Golden Rough for my usual radio show. Here, you Pokemon should have some rest. Do 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 loo. Sweet. I'm depending on you. Right, I could look at his stuff, but let's uh get a phone call from Professor Elm. It's a disaster. It's just terrible. It. Oh no! Please get back here now. Click. Uh. Pr 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 you don't need to talk to me, Professor, or am I just gonna have to, like come back randomly? Oh, the toil. Get. Gotcha. Spaff grew to level eight. This does help a little bit, especially since I'm wanting to do more story than uh, random Pokemon encounters. Right. Let's heal Spaff. No. Jenny. Whoa, rival. A wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Goofy smile he's got. Who oh, sent out Totodile? Go, Spaff. Gotta love the extra animations the Game Boy Color could do. And of course, it still hits. And dead. Spaff grew to level 9. Huh, are you happy you weren't? Did I got 300 yen for winning? I don't know, did I? My name's Question Mark. I'm gonna be the world's greatest. Wait, did, did I name him Question Mark? I don't recall naming them. Stuck on a sign. Let's touch that person up there. The spaff is healed right now. Ooh, yes, they tell me about berries, don't they? Oh no, they're waiting for Pokemon at night. Yeah, see, this is where it's going to be, um. Uh. If I want to complete my Pokedex, it's going to be a little bit. Aha, I'm falling for that. A little bit more difficult, because obviously Pokemon come out at night now. Which means... 
got to play it day and night. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. It was a young male with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? And his name... What shall it be? It shall be... Mega turn. Mega turn. Mega turn was his name. That's it. Nothing else. This is terrible. Oh yes. What was Mr. Parkman's big discovery? Did I hand the mystery egg to Professor Elm? Is it a Pokemon egg? It is a great discovery. And a Pokedex. Take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. The Pokemon Gaim. Make sure that you talk to your mother. I just want to leave town. Heal him. Nothing else we can do. We're not allowed to... Whoop. I received a Pokeball. I will need many of those. Hmm. <laughs> right, let's talk to me mother then. And we'll head out on our epic quest. See, now this is kind of weird. Professor Elm, I wasn't going to get a Pokemon on my 10th birthday, unlike Ash. Yes, save my money. Right. Time to go on an adventure. Call your mom on your Pokemon gear to let her know how you're doing. And with that, folks, we'll leave it here in our epic beginnings. What I'm going to do is level up and catch a few Pokemon, and see you in the next part. So, thank you very much for watching. I've been Loopy Third, and I hope you've enjoyed. See you soon.